Hello everyone, Raptor X here, and uh, today we're gonna actually move. Finally, we're gonna get uh, to start using our new base. And uh, what I want to show you guys here is actually that both cores are done. Now, what this means is I can unplug all this stuff, get rid of all the tubes and uh, whatever the pipes, where all this stuff is, and transfer all this stuff to the to the new base. Now, um, I did do some work. Uh, between episodes, I finished uh, with the lighting on the new base, and uh, I actually created another solar array. Mainly because I didn't want to spend a third episode just making solar array. I do have some material left over, and uh, I was considering maybe. Uh, yep, I was making also more rubber. Mainly because I need a lot of rubber for the. If you want to keep on making more solar arrays, I have plenty of coal dust and plenty of glass in here. Always glass is pretty cheap, but the coal dust, on the other hand, not so much, since it doesn't have EMC value and it's um, yeah, you have to macerate it. But I, I made I had three stacks before, so after I was done, uh, I think I had three stacks or maybe a little bit more. I'm not sure, uh, but it, uh, this is what I have left now, so it's still quite a bit, not bad. Um, I do need a lot more iron, I believe. Hope this stops lagging a little bit. So I have to, uh, shy of two stacks of iron and uh, not very much of uh, refined, which is what I need here. So what I'm going to do though, I'm going to first transfer everything over. Um, what I do want to do maybe is make some more glass fiber cable, and I'll check really quick because I always forget the recipe for this cable. And uh, now. Uh, last episode, actually, I had a, a few problems with my mic. It was uh, acting up a little bit, and uh, mainly because it was a new headset and I didn't set it up properly. So I'm sorry if it, it sounded a little bit, uh, I would say, synthetic, almost electronic. I don't know why, why else it sounded like that. But uh, but yeah, um, unfortunately, I didn't realize it was uh, set up wrong until after I was done with the episode. But um, but yeah, hopefully it sounds better today. Uh, and uh, yeah, I'll keep on fine-tuning it until I get the the right settings. All right, now to make some glass fiber cable, I want to make quite a bit. Like I said, I, I want to run this behind the wall and from the little power room we made. So we need some silver ingots, which we do have quite a bit of them actually. Uh, diamond and uh, glass, which we have plenty of. Um, let's see here, silver. All right, let's grab a few of those. Do I have any diamonds? I thought I had some diamonds on me. All right, so I'm gonna leave that there. Don't have any more of those. That's fine. And uh, let's see, let's make uh, three, maybe. I don't know how much I'll need. Let's grab some glass. Let's dump all this stuff in here. All right. All right, 18. Um, do I have any more laying around? Because I don't think that's gonna be nearly enough. I have two here. Um, I'll make one more set. Actually, two more. And I'll have to take down the cable I do have here because that I want to start running the machines directly from uh, this kind of cable instead of using the the bronze, the, the copper cable. Sorry, uh, sorry. The yeah, I don't know what I'm going on about, but yeah, I want to stop using the bronze cable mainly because it's not as efficient as the glass fiber cable. And uh, all right, glass fiber cable, and I want to make to make two more. Let's do this. There we go. Um, crap, forgot to put in the top slot. All right, there you go. Let's dump this in here for now. How's this going? Mm, I want to make. While well, I set up the power, I'll leave the the extractor running with some uh, sticky resin. In there. Let's see here. Actually, what I'm going to do here, since this is not going to uh, carry over, I guess, I'm just going to grab all of it. Because uh, otherwise, I'll lose that EMC. Because I don't want to pick it up. So I'm just going to dump all this sticky resin in there for now. I'll take this, put it in here. Grab this. Um, bum, 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 rubber. 
Where did I leave the rubber? Okay, I have it all in here. So I'm going to put all that in my alchemy bag. Start putting stuff in there. And, uh... Yeah. Alright, so let's take this out. I do have quite a bit of power left, still. But, um... The first thing I want to set up is the power in the, the new base. So I don't believe I can reach that. Oh, okay. That's one way of doing it. How much power do I left? Okay. I have a bit left. Alright, so... Uh, I believe I can run it off the bad box. Um, oh, what to do? What to do? What to do? I don't want to lose that power, man. So six hundred, almost six hundred thousand EMC there. I mean EMC, no EU. Don't want to lose it. I know if I make some um, energy crystals, but then I will use up the diamonds. Um, uh, well, oh well, I'll start setting up the energy system there hopefully oh what I, I what I will do though is put all the machines to work so I'll leave one in there I'll put two in here how many are in here it's one none in there all right so I'll just dump uh, some iron actually that's only I want to grab a full stack I'll take a full stack of tin so I can uh, leave and come back and hopefully it starts withdrawing all that power there you go alright now let's head over get our solar panels solar arrays actually I have three low voltage ones now as you can see here and I need my wrench no that's not what I want to do here it is Alright. Now, if I set it up as a kind of like a, I'm not sure you guys know about this, it's called the power flower. Right in the middle, right here actually. Instead of having it. Ow. Scrub this. There you go. And just put the cable here. and then put that there um... you know what? No, I'm not doing it this way it would be more efficient but then later on it would be kind of annoying so hold it right, right here actually, just put those three there and uh, there you go. Run the cable right here. I'm gonna put it all to go into this MFV that's gonna be there. Then into LV transformer, then to a battery box, and then I want to run it really like above here, like at this level. But if I put other solar panels, I mean, I don't know if it will eventually fill this up. I, I don't think so. Especially since as soon as I get eight of these, I'm gonna upgrade to a medium voltage solar array. So I guess I'll be fine for now. Not really too worried about space. Um. So yeah. Let's see here. MFE. I'll put a cable here. That's where the M M L V transformer will go. Another cable here. This is where the battery box will go, and then immediately run it up this way. Um. Hmm. This is a lot of uh, cable I'm using up here. Grab all this stuff. I'm gonna go straight here because I just want to go around the um, the wall here. 
that's where I should make a door uh, set it up but uh, yeah so gonna run the cable here not sure how far but I do want to keep at least four of these cables actually if now that I think about it if I put a battery box here maybe or here directly I'm just trying to see what would look better and it doesn't make much sense to make it look better I just want it to look clean I guess it's not it's the word I was going for but uh but yeah pretty much what it would do is um I'll do that I'll put the LV transformer here carry the power into the battery box and that way I'll lose less power because after a certain amount of blocks I forget how many it is I think I believe it's maybe 10 blocks it starts losing power so what I could do is put a battery box here halfway act as a, as a buffer for the energy and then send it back out it will not lose any mm, forgot the word it's like a uh, engineering terms would be amps I think I believe but uh I'm not sure what would be the word for tech it <laughs> but yeah just uh, the, the strength of the signal I guess will be but yeah oh yeah so yeah as you can see here I already set up all the all the lamps they're all set up nicely the whole area is nicely clean there's no torches laying around it's very lit up no mobs and it's raining again I swear every day it's raining in Minecraft it's rather annoying just glad I have a uh, Matmos disabled now let's see what else I have here hopefully this power is already running out let's check that out no wow plenty of it still left um, take that out, put that in my bag of goodies. That's still going at pace very quickly here. Hmm, how long has it been? Alright, I can start moving this stuff, I guess. Yeah. Oh, the mess of items. Alright, now. Pick this up. Ooh, plenty of stuff in here. Uh, just pick it up. Hopefully, I have. I don't have space in my inventory. Um, let's see here. Dump that in there. Um, because I want to keep all these samples in my inventory. I'll dump that. Dump this, all the ores. Alright, I'll dump all the ores in there. Let's grab the rest. Alright, so I have just enough. Do I have the chest in my inventory? Okay, perfect. So I'll start transferring all this stuff over there. Now, I know I could set up a um, teleporter and pipe or whatever it's called and uh, pump everything back in here. But um, I need somewhere to pump it to. And for that, I need these pipes. Now, I'm going to put the teleport pipe right here and that's where all the items are going to come in through. Kind of like how I had it in the, um, the tutorial series for those that saw that. Um, so yeah, let's set this up there. Some cobblestone pipe there. Actually, I'll put an iron pipe there. Because I want to have an, um, a, a chest here where I can dump items and I'll sort them out down the chain here. Um, but that's further down the line, so I'll just do this for now into a diamond pipe. Now, I want to quickly check actually, because what I wanted to do instead of uh, using tubes, I mean not tubes, instead of using pipes I want to use tubes, the pneumatic tube which is uh, red power but to do that I need sorting machines and I forget how expensive these are if at all um, I need silver nickelite which is why I need all that nickelite now because I need one per um, hold on that's not what I needed what is iron? okay filters I need two gold plenty of pistons plenty of uh, Cobblestone, I say easy. Cold on the head, it's not that cheap to make the filters. 
silicon wafers, silicon buell, sand. All right, so the only expensive thing I can really notice here is the gold ingots, which I'm making a few right now. And I shouldn't need that many machines in the first place. So I, I obviously still need the, the pipes in here because uh, I'm going to need uh, to teleport the items in. But then I was thinking now I could run this into a chest immediately. Um. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do here. I'm going to set it up the old way, which means I'm going to put a, a diamond pipe here with all the sample items that I don't need. For example, the energy condenser, I'll dump that in here. Do I have any more cobblestone transport pipes? Okay, I have one more. Perfect. So in here, what is this? Black. Black. Perfect. Gravel, obsidian, cobblestone. Oh, the items I don't want. Sandstone. Sand. For that matter, even wooden planks, because I'd be getting that from the mine shafts as well. Marble. Gravel. Wow, it's a full line. Alright, now, does that mean it has everything? I believe it does. So, what it, this will do is up. This whole thing is going to come, whatever is left, pretty much, will come to this pipe and to this chest. And then out of this chest, I can pull stuff out into the sorting machines. Now, um, I'm obviously going to make all that machinery on camera. But uh, I'm going to have to do a little, do a little thinking beforehand, see how I'm going to lay this all out. Because um, I'm going to need to make the, the other solar panels. And uh, so it's going to be a f at least three episodes, I believe, before I have this base back up and running to the way I want it set up. And this is the solar panel I need, uh, fuels and all this other stuff. So I'm going to run all this stuff here, put uh, other solar panels above, I believe, maybe in, on this side and run the cables down this way. Because it, it's a whole different mod. It's kind of annoying. Can you? How you I guess it's nice because it gives more variety to the game, but it's kind of annoying how you can't convert it like the other mods. It's not one that plays along very nicely unless you're using the sorting machines, and that is amazing the way that works. But uh, but yeah, what this would act as is pretty much a, like a buffer. Items come in here, it filters them out. Whatever's junk goes in, in instantly to a condenser. Whatever goes into here will then be sucked out to be processed, sorted, and machined, smelted, macerated, everything. Which is why this room is so long. It looks like almost like a hallway. But uh, but yeah, should have plenty of room to do all of my crazy experiments with the macerators and all that stuff. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna cut it now here, mainly because uh, I want to look a little bit at the recipes and be a little bit more prepared for next episode to see what we're gonna do first. I'm gonna have a little prioritization prioritization. <laughs> uh, of the blocks I want to make first. So yeah, uh, until next time, bye.